All right, yeah, this is another PayPal from Johans. This is another, yeah, surprise band for me. Not what I was expecting at all. Um, but fire. But yeah, this one is tattooed love. Yeah, ta tattooed love boys. I don't know why that sounds weird in my head. Tattooed love boys. Yeah. Official video. Hopefully this doesn't get blocked. But it might. But it'll be up on Rumble. But yeah. Tattooed love boys. Pretenders. Let's go. To me 20 doors. Around a hot back and blue pretty love boys. I tore my knees up get sent to you cause I need it. just blows my mind because it's her that I kind of know of I always like I just know her name and I know her um, she was on a um, on Russell Brand's radio show um, but for some reason I always just had her kind of pegged as like a not a pop star but basically like a pop star like a but these are a legit punk band like legit not they don't sound either like a manufactured um like a mainstream act clinging to the new sound they sound legit punk they look legit punk she's got that that kind of swagger an attitude. She's probably the most f nearest to male energy of all the females that we do. Beth Hart's very feminine. PJ Harvey, I suppose you could put on there, but PJ Harvey's different. 
her, she like literally has that aggression of, yeah. And her dance moves are great. He, the bass player as well, looked exactly like the bass player from um, The Clash. Mick, is it Mick? Yeah. Absolute fire tune. But she's like, that's, I just can't get it in, into my head. It, just, it hasn't sunk in and to make sense yet that this is, this is the Pretenders. Like, again, they're another band that you know the name. To be honest, I don't even think of, I knew Chrissy Hine was in the Pretenders. I think I knew the name Pretenders. I knew the name. Chrissy Hine, but yeah. Mental. Proper punk band. Like, proper punk band. Yeah. Fire. Tune. Absolute tune. But yeah, that's the reaction. Sweet. 